Hello and welcome to another Excel Tips video. I am Sumit Bansal and in this video, I'm going to show you how to filter those cells that have a strike through format applied to it. Now this cannot be done using the inbuilt filter in Excel because there is no option to filter based on the strike through format. However, this can be done with a simple workaround. So in this video, I'm going to show you two such workarounds. So let's see what these are. Here I have this data set where I have these tasks and you can see some of the cells have the strike through format applied to it. And I only want to filter these tasks. Now, as I said, you cannot do this using the inbuilt filter. So let me show you how to do this using find and replace where we are going to find all these cells that have this strike through format applied, give them a cell color and then filter based on the cell color. So here I'm going to select all these cells. Then I'm going to hold the control key and press the F key. So it opens the find and replace dialog box. Now here within find what I don't want to find based on the cell value. I want to find based on the cell format. So I'm going to come here to this format button, click on this drop down icon. And here I'm going to choose format. And when I click on it, it opens the find format dialog box where within the font tab, I'm going to check this option called strike through. What this is going to do is it is going to find all the cells that could have any formatting, but as long as it has the strike through format applied to it, it will be found. So I click OK. So you can see in preview, it shows me the format that it is going to find. And now I'm going to click on find all. And when I do this, it finds all the cells that have this format and shows me the list here. So when I press control A, so I hold the control key, press the A key. And when I do that, it is going to select all these cells that have this format applied. Now I can close this, I can go to the home tab and here I can apply a color to it. So let's say I, I apply this color to it. Now, as I mentioned, you cannot filter based on the strike through format, but you can filter based on the cells color. So I'm going to select any of these cells, right click, go to filter option and here click on filter by selected cells color. And as soon as I click on it, it filters all these cells and these are only those cells that have the strike through format applied to it. Another simple way to filter cells with strike through format is by creating our own user defined function using VBA and then use that function to get a true in case uh, there is a strike through format or false if there is not. So in this case, I'm going to create a helper column that I'm going to use to filter this data. And now I'm going to create a user defined function with VBA. So I'm going to go to the developer tab here and then click on the visual basic icon. You can also use the keyboard shortcut Alt F11. So hold the Alt key and press the F11 key. So and it is also going to open the same visual basic editor. Now here I'm going to go on insert option and then click on module. And this is where I'm going to write my code. Now this is a very simple code. It is going to be function, then the name of the function. So let's say the name of my function in this case could be check SR, which is check strike through. And then I need to specify what input this function is going to take. So I would say it is going to take a, a range. So RNG as a range. And that's it. Now I just need to have one single line of code that is going to give me a true or a false where I would say check SR is equal to RNG, which is the range that would be given to the function. And within this, I'm going to check whether the font has strike through or not. That's it. So this is going to check whether the cell that I give to this formula has the strike through applied or not. If it has this applied, this is going to return true, else it is going to return false. So now I can go back to my sheet here and I can use this function check SR. It is going to show up in the IntelliSense. And now I can select this cell and hit enter. And this, this gives me true because there is strike through format applied to this cell and I can drag this down. Now, once I have it, I can apply filter to this data set. So I can use the keyboard shortcut control shift L. So hold the control and the shift key or press and then press the L key. Or you can go to the data tab here and then click on this filter icon. And when you do that, it applies the filter. Now I can come here and then I can filter based on the value true, which would give me all these cells that only has the strike through format applied to it. So these are two simple methods you can use to quickly filter cells that have the strike through format applied to it. That's it in this video. I hope you found this useful. Also, if you're liking these videos, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and click on the bell icon so that you never miss out on any new Excel tips video I come up with. Thank you and have a nice day.